Hey everyone, Jalen Barron, the star of the Netflix series Free Rain, is here to talk about that and much, much more. Stay tuned. You're tuning into the destination for TV superfan discussion, After Buzz TV. And now, let the buzz begin. Hey guys, all right, I'm your host, Veronica Briga. Next to me is the lovely and talented Jalen Barron. Hello. Hi. Well, welcome. Thank you for having me. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, so are you from, well, you're not from L.A., are you? I am. You are? I am. Oh, I'm from L.A., yeah. <laughs> I'm from um, La Puente, California. Okay. So it's about 20 miles east of here. But, yeah, that's, that's where I'm from, born and raised. I'm smiling because I grew up very close to you. Really? <laughs> where? Where? In Rosemead. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> La Puente, Covina area. <laughs> <laughs> We're neighbors. We don't even know it. I know, right? <laughs> that's great. Um, well, this is cool. So you've got, you're the star of a big, big show on Netflix. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. That's a big deal. Um, tell us a little bit about Free Rain for those who, who maybe have not seen it just yet. So, basically, Free Rain is about, um, a, it's just a coming-of-age drama. Drama. It has comedy, there's love, everything about it is child oriented. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm the American girl, I go over there, I fall in love with this mysterious horse, and we are inseparable. But in order to find out the rest, you must watch season one. On yes, Netflix. and by the way, it's also an Emmy Award winning series. Girl, two Emmys? Ah, okay, two, get two. it right. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations Thank on you. that. Thank That's you. a big deal. Yeah, it was just this past Sunday, and what was so funny is that me and the cast, we kept, we were, we were nominated for six Emmys. Oh, wow. Right, so we got two, wow. so still blessed, you know what I mean? But we were sitting there, and as they were announcing um, each winner or each nominee, we were like, we're not going to get this one, you know? Oh. For the best children's program overall, we're like, whatever, we're just going to, whatever, guys. It's fun to be here anyway, you know? And then when they said free reign, we were all just like, wait, they said our names? That was us? And we all just looked at each other, and then we all got up and we were like running on stage, and I was so afraid. I, I was this close to tripping, honestly. On my dress, I was this close. It's a you would have had a J Law moment, but that's all right. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So we're, what's it like when you're just? I mean, were you like were you like thump thump the whole time, or were you just like yeah? It's okay. I'm ready for whatever. I was not hungry the entire day because my anxiety was through the roof. Yeah. But um, yeah. I what I was really concerned about is tripping in front of everybody <laughs> while going on stage to accept the award. That's that's honestly what all that's my anxiety biggest, is about. Yeah. Because yeah. I just feel like it's such an honor to even be nominated and even yeah. to be thought about for the Emmys that I would have appreciated just that title. But the fact that we won is even better, of it's course. A great deal, mm -hmm. yes. And you're also nominated for an NAACP award. Yes, yes, That's, yes. Th this is great. Yeah, yeah it, was, it was an honor, really. It was just great to even be in that environment That's for such a cause. And especially me being a minority, it was so important for me to be there. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. what, do, what do you think it is about the show that resonates with viewers uh, so much? I think it's because it's so wholesome. I really think that's what it is, and I feel like kids, they don't have a lot of dramas that they can really get into without their parents supervising them. Sure. So really, they can just click on this show and watch it without their parents having to be over their shoulder. It has drama, it has the boys, it has the girls, it has it has everything that you would want in a series for kids. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing crazy about it. <laughs> I know, keep the kids innocent. Give them some good exactly. like, go entertainment with substance. Exactly, you know? exactly. Teach them something. It has life lessons in it, and I think that's extremely important for girls today, because yeah. I feel like the role Model, role models aren't aren't really present as of right now. You know what I mean? Okay. There's there's a lot of them, of course. But yeah. You know what I mean? Is that something that that um, is important to you for it's, you for you to be a role model? Because you are in the limelight and people look up to you. Yeah, I think it's extremely important because when I was younger, I looked up to amazing women. And I really, I really thought that I could be them one day. You know what I mean? I looked up to Holly Berry, and I am convinced I will be Holly Berry one day, one of these days. So I really feel like girls need somebody to look up to. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're doing it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so you, um, you actually, or actually, season two has been announced. Season for yeah. free reign. Mm -hmm. You better get. They want Emmys. You better give them a season two, three, and four. <laughs> right. Okay. But yeah, we already filmed season two. Oh. Yeah, we already filmed season two, and it's gonna be released soon. But Okay. They're so quiet, they're so secretive on when we're gonna start filming and if they're gonna say anything. And it's like, can we just please let these people know? Let, because yeah. <laughs> on all over my Instagram, they're like, when is season two? You're not telling us. And it's like, I can't, I'll get in trouble. Yeah, yeah, I know. They make you sign the. Yeah, the, the yeah. Stuff. Like, I will literally get in trouble. I'll lose my job, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> but it is coming soon, we can say. Coming, very soon, very soon. soon. Yes. What uh, What can you tell? Can you. What, don't, don't get in trouble, but tell right. us a little bit about season two. Okay, a little bit about season two. Oof. 
um, Zoe ends up with one of the people that you guys like, like that you guys are fans of, you guys are shipping. Did I say it right? Shipping? Sure. Yeah, okay. You guys are shipping. Um, that's honestly all I can say. Okay. Yeah, it's such a big secret. I love it. And what's, um, what's it like, because you work with a, a horse, like mm -hmm. what's it like working with animals? It's... <sighs> I love animals. Uh -huh. I do. I love them. But it is so hard working with them because if they do not want to do something, the show won't go on. The show is about horses. Yeah. So if that horse is feeling like he needs to poop in that scene, <laughs> guess what he's going to do? He's going to poop in that scene. And we have to start the scene all over again because of the horse. And I love them, but oh my boy. Do they? Do they're they too much. <laughs> they're too much. They are. They're sassy animals. <laughs> you wouldn't expect it, but they're just like, I don't feel like getting pet today. So you'll try and touch their head and they'll like move it out the way. Oh, and wow. I'm like, well, okay, sorry, girl. My bad. <laughs> mm. what, um, so how many, do they have like maybe two horses that they sort of, that look the that, same? Yeah, yeah, that they switch, yeah, that they switch out. Yeah, okay. we, def we have two horses because, you know, laws and stuff yeah, like yeah, that. We have to make sure, sure they're not tired. Yeah. And I'm always so strict. I'm like, did the horses get some water? Aww. Are the horses getting any snacks? They're like, Jalen, we can't give the horse a snack because he's not going to listen. And I'm like, please Aww. just give him a snack. <laughs> I love that behind the scenes. Um, so you started actually, you started as Carl's, well, you've done quite a bit, but mm -hmm. one of your, your bigger roles before this was Carl's girlfriend. Yes, on Shameless. On Shameless, yeah. Shameless mm -hmm. yeah. Completely different than Zoe from Free Rain. Completely different. Yeah. I don't know if you've seen it, but Carl and Jay and uh, Zoe, Dominique, sorry. <laughs> Carl and Dominique, whew. They were naughty. Get, get into a little kids. bit of trouble, right? A lot of yeah. trouble. Just completely different from Zoe, but I like the fact that I was able to play both characters and people can see the change. Yeah. And see that I can be serious and dramatic and, and you know, rude. Yeah. And then Zoe is wholesome and sweet and, and just so just so calm, you know? I like that. And you're also very funny. Thank you. You are. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah, you do it all. Thank you. Good diversity here. Um, so how has your life changed since you, you know, started booking all these big shows and going to the Emmys and, and being a star? I mean, honestly, my, like, my family, they're so funny. They don't even pay attention to it. Like, they do not care at all. And I think maybe it's different in the essence of I walk down the street and people recognize me. And I always have to make sure I'm behaving correct. Not that I sure, behave sure. any other way, but I just always make sure I'm on my P's and Q's. Sure. But uh, my home life, everything is really the same. My family's just like, girl, we don't care. Come on, whip up those tamales really fast. You know what I mean? <laughs> they don't care at all. Like, I still have to be slaving on Christmas, you know, with the masa. You, so you must be Mexican then. My mom is Mexican. Yeah, yeah and my dad's black. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can hear you. I can hear it. I can hear it. I knew. I it's knew. my Mexican sister. Hello. <laughs> Long last, girl. But yeah, they yeah. don't care at all. But I, th I like that. Yeah. I like that nobody is treating me different. And everything is everything's the same for me, and I'm really I'm really fortunate to say that that I have a really steady steady home life. They keep you grounded. Exactly, they keep me grounded. Yeah, yeah. They're all they're all from the hood, but that's I think that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. They must be very proud of you. Thank you. Um. So yeah. So uh, before we go, tell us about what it's like when you know little girls come up to you and and just want to take a picture and they look up to you. That must feel real good. It does, cause they're so sweet and they're so shy at first. They're like. Hi, um, are you Zoe from Free Rain? And I'm like, yes. And they're like, can we take a picture with you? And they're so sweet. And they're all horsey girls. And I never realized how many people rode horses. Oh, sure. Until this show came out. <laughs> I, I really never realized it. And then everybody rides horses. And everybody loves horses. I could see why, but I just, I never expected it. Yeah. And I'm just glad that, like I said, they get to watch something so wholesome on TV. And it gets to have their, their drama and their love and stuff like that. That's, that's what I really like about it. Amazing. Um, cool. Well, where can they find you on uh, social media before we go? So my Twitter is Jalen J. Barron, and my Instagram is Jalen Barron. I'm verified on Instagram and get almost on Twitter. We're working on it. <laughs> <laughs> get with it, Twitter. She yeah, is I know, right? Emmy Award winning actress. So to tell the difference between the different Twitters, it's Bouge for short. So my... My necklace is with bougie, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, it was great talking to you. Thank you so much for having me. Yes, it's been a pleasure. And you guys, uh, make sure to check out Free Rain on uh, Netflix. From executive producers Maria Menounos, Kevin Undergaro, Phil Svitek, and the entire AfterBuzz TV staff, we would like to thank you for listening to the AfterBuzz TV network. To watch or listen to other after shows and post comments or questions, be sure to visit AfterBuzzTV.com. I'm Sir Richard Wentworth, and this has been a presentation of AfterBuzz TV. Buzz you later.